Hey all, welcome to Art Alchemy. Um, today I'm going to bring you a short video. So I'm probably going to be a, do a series of short videos with the stuff that I got. And then I'm going to do a really long video. I forgot to tell you guys yesterday at the end of my other video that I I actually ordered three orders of Jackson's. Like back to back um, since thurs Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And there was a reason for that because every day I kept um, something different went on on sale. So that is the reason. So I wanted to make the, I like the first two shipments, I, they only charged me $1.99. So that was really good. And then the third shipment and final one, they did charge me about $8. But that's why I kind of put like five things. So because the difference was like a dollar or 50 cents. So I was like, I might as well just make it worth for me. Because y'all know, I hate really, um, I, I hate when they charge us for shipping um so yeah <clears throat> that is a thing so today i'm gonna bring you the farber castell so um i got this sunday night and i do believe it's still on sale i will double check and put it under my description um actually i'll, I'll put the link and it only cost me you guys six sixteen dollars so with taxes like eighteen dollars so that was the reason that I returned, but I'm going to return. I already made the little um, request on Amazon to return one of my Pentel pens. Um, though, cause it was the same, they were good pens. Don't get me wrong, but they were the same, um, the same, hold on a second. Okay, back, sorry. I was gonna make myself coffee. So the, my uh, water went off, so I didn't, I didn't want you to hear it. So anyway, um, I was gonna say that Pentel, yeah, I got those for fun. And so I kept the touch, which were the cheapest, believe it or not, because they were identical, same colors as the other ones who were more expensive, but they were the felt tip, so felt tip. So I just, I'm gonna return back the felt, felt tip. And then, you know, so they can give me my money back and hopefully I'll buy more of these. So this, I, this is like a mixed media. This is geared towards to mixed media and you know, I am a mixed media person. So, um, and then this is an actual tin that you could reuse. So I, I was watching a lot of unboxing videos like on Friday, between Friday and Saturday. So I found this early on Sunday morning and I was like, oh my God, I remember that I wanted to get like a last year an art box just to get these because I saw somebody unbox their their um their box and they said oh my god these are so good yada, yada, yada. and then they do have them individually on art snacks website they do have they do sell them open stock so does Blick and I heard the person from the unboxing because she wanted to get a whole collection of them um she and she got some doubles because she got some here some on ebay some billy blick and somewhere else and they're expensive they're like um 3.99 because they're big they're the uh, these are the um albert Dewar, but these are the magnus these are the huge pins not the regular uh, albert Dewar. and i'll show you guys because i have the i have these which i got remember last week these are craft but they are also Barber Castell, um, Goldfather, these are more like gear towards um, uh, crafts, and but they are watercolor pencils as well. They're not life fast. And I would also link later today um, the video that I got from the Mine of Watercolor that he actually reviewed, not these. He reviewed the, the regular ones, um, the regular Albert Durer ones that most people have. And it's, uh, there's a wider range for that um, if you're interested. I am not because I already have these and I'm really happy with these. I'm, these I got from my art boxes and usually the little ones that I get and it was cheap and it was two of them from Derwin. And these I just got and um, I have a couple of other ones. So I'm happy with that and since I'm on mixed media. So I, I immediately ordered this. I said, I gotta have this. Cause I was already thinking of returning one of my um, Pentel. I was just like, but this is um, like I said, I will link it for you because if you are on a budget or whatever, I also knew by the art of, um, I mean the mind of watercolor. He, like I said, he's a total legit. 
he was an illustrator for a long time and he like he's been doing watercolor for a long time he also mentioned that these and the regular albedure are light fast um so and also i found through another video that if you have arthritis or some sort of problem with your hands these are good for that and yes it's true because i swatched them just right now before i went live on the video and yes it is it is super pigmented as soon as you drop that water it melts like butter and look at this look at the look how big they are it is a 3.5 core um pencils and it comes with i really like this set that's why i said if you want it for yourself you're in a budget i mean 18 dollars with tax i got it through amazon and i have prime look at that this is a really nice i love farber castell um artist pit so this is a fine liner and it it's black it's black and um it i'm sorry and it um it, it is like butter like it's so nice i also like the artist pits and i have them through thankfully my a lot of my art boxes i have them in different colors the brush sets and they're so good and this one i was excited that it actually comes also with a brush um it's a tan round so yeah that's what i said that this will make a really good um for an artist and but it's geared to mixed media that's why it has like a little bit of everything and this is plastic but you could take it off and i will do that um and just use the tin because this is a really good tin like this is a really good tin and i'm probably gonna move some of my because they don't fit in here on the dirt one so let me show you the the um the comparison uh between it's not gonna be a long video i'm sorry i've been seven talking for like three minutes see how how what's the difference they're pretty and i really like this because i i got the i have the furby ones so like i said i from Faber Castell we have these and I, I meant to get them last year and i completely forgot but i'm glad because now i got the all of these on sale and i didn't have to get them individually and these i got you know through the clearance from um tuesday morning and a bunch of other things and that's why it i um when i saw these i'm like i have to get them because these are actually really good um and it comes with a brush as well and these are craft and they're cheaper and they're um they are not life fast but if you're on a tight budget and let's say you don't care about life fastness then this will be good for you and you could get the whole range for like 25 bucks through jackson's so yeah these do not and these i like them these i think they're only like 40 of them in the range and they are pretty pricey that's why i got this because the 24 set is like 70 something so i was like oh no and um so i was like i just gonna get this and you know use them as mixed media and if i like them i'll just i'll just um i get coupons a lot actually you guys sign up for like our snacks or whatever they give you a lot of coupons and they usually tell you when there's a sale um the other day they sent me a coupon for like 50 percent off and i used it i that's how i got more derwin because i got two little boxes i didn't show you guys because i already had shown you guys it's a tiny little box that comes with like a like it's like a mixed media and i really like it because i ended up paying 15 dollars for it um and including shipping and i got two of them and they ship them to me super fast like they got here like in three days total like on the third day i got them <laughs> so yeah so this is the swatch this is a swatch that i did for this set for the set that i just got um i swatched these already but i will swatch one for you and then i'm gonna end the video here so yeah like i said look at that so vibrant and it looks identical to how the watercolor does it this is a mixed media cheap um, so I'm using it now um, as a like to um, you know to to just test stuff but look at how vibrant and how as soon as I drop that water it melt it melt like butter so I'm going to show you the difference between this one and this one this is the um, it is called the Goldfather Aqua and like I said this is not life fast this is just like a 
geared for crafts, for beginners, for like people that are not concerned with life crafts. And according to the mine of um, watercolor, a lot of these, I think the Alberdour, these ones, the Magnus and the regular Alberdour, are in the top two along with um with uh for life fastness that is and you could get all the information through the Farber Cassell website and also the other ones the museum the Carandash Museum of Aquarelle see how see what's the difference like these are super light and look at that and I actually let me let me use another color so you could see you these are yeah they're super light compared so yeah that's that's the difference i mean yeah and i also just fyi if you want to get the faber castell right now their amazon is running a sale i will link that as well on this video but they are also having a sale with um it's 88 dollars it's still pricey but they are the big um dual um dual ended watercolor uh markers and they look a lot like this a lot of people have reviewed them so i check because i put them under my wish list i'm not gonna buy them now i'm probably gonna buy them towards like maybe summer the end of the year i don't know um and obviously on sale and a lot of people bought them for 120 but right now on amazon they're 88 dollars so and there are there are life fast there as there is a lot of people like them because they're easier on your hand and they look identical to watercolor like I have, remember I have the um, Winsor Newton and those are more expensive. I got them on sets, but I only have 25 and those are a bigger range. But like I said, they're more expensive. And so these um, Faber-Castell ones, they look a lot like the Eco dye, the Eco, um, Eco line, but those are dye based. Um, the only two that are not dye based are the Winsor Newton ones a watercolor which are expensive and these farber castell watercolor markers that are, are the only two that they are absolute for artists so fyi so yeah this is all i have and i'm sorry i keep talking but um yeah so you see the difference and it, like i said it's 16 dollars. i will link that below okay you guys have a nice day Bye bye